Well, sometimes with fashion or art, mm -hmm. you look at a thing that's pretty trendy and you're like, wait, that price tag, could I make this? Mm, I think that all the time. Right? Well, wonder no more, folks. It's time for DIY or, or buy. Fashion edition with the DIY designer herself, Orly Shaw. Oh! What's up, baby? Oh, I'm so happy to be here. This is going to be so fun. Can These are tell? some good pieces. They yes. are really good pieces. Yeah. Can you tell that we are super excited today? We're yeah, ready. It's a tie. Yeah. It's a tie for excitement. We're ready. Yeah. Okay, so what do you do? Let's say you're you're yeah. on, you know, you're clicking through Instagram or mm -hmm. some of the other stores online, and you're like, mm, am I gonna click click on this one? Yeah. Or could I just make this? Yeah. The wonderful thing about right now is we are deep in spring, and it's just it's like all about like fun and embellishments yes. and color and details and all these wonderful things that are actually very easy to DIY. But because they are the trends, designers are making them and selling them for a lot of money. Yes. Right. So it can go both ways, and it really depends on your skill set. So we're going to go through a couple of them, and I'm dying to know what you think is actually a buy mm. versus DIY. Mm. Oh, well, I think I'm pretty terrible at this game, so I, <laughs> I, can't, I, wait. I can't imagine <laughs> this The worse you are, the happier I'll be. Okay. So let's start off with <laughs> these jumping right skirts. in. Let's do it. Let's, let's do go. It. Let's go. These okay, ready? are sequin fringe skirts. As you can see, it's all about the detail here on the bottom. Love. Okay. The reason I think this is such a huge trend is everyone's just really, really excited to get back out. Exactly. Yes. Like, we have places to go. We have things to do and so having details like this is going to be really great so this could potentially be a diy it could potentially be a buy what do you guys think listen i the i was at church on sunday and a woman was so excited literally she wore her club attire no she church, didn't because she just ready to get out of the house <laughs> i feel her so i'm gonna say i'm gonna say bye on that i'm gonna say i'm gonna <gasps> oh. say bye okay on that. okay okay sibley mm. Mm. Okay, DIY. DIY. So much. somebody gotta be right scott you're right <laughs> It's a buy. This is a really you said great you were bad piece. At this. this is wonderful, <laughs> and really the reason I'd suggest buying it is if you find something within your price point that fits you great, this is a great piece as is, yeah. and you can just go for it and buy it. Okay. okay. Let's move on to the jacket. jacket. Now, mm. this is a denim jacket. It actually is incorporating quite a few trends. The floral embroidery is a really big trend. Obviously, okay. you guys probably remember seeing Taylor Swift at the Grammys and that amazing cropped little mini yes. Oscar yes. de la Renta, right? So, good. so floral embroidery is Ooh. really cool. Cutouts are huge. Don't mind if I do. I'll show you. You can see whatever color you're wearing is going to pop through. I it's love got that. all this it's really fun. It's getting yeses. Like, yes. like, oh, we're going what? out. Do you, wait, is, this this, thing? is this a personal situation or I can buy this after? Oh, look. Well, we got a oh, DIY yeah. 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 That's the whole point of the game. The I mean, after we're done here, you yeah. buy it from, you, from <laughs> this is, one. Do you guess that this is a buy or a DIY, you guys? I'm going to go DIY. That's okay. what I feel like. It's a DIY. Yeah! It's a DIY. It is my DIY. This is something I made. You guys can take a look. It's super simple to do. All you're going to do is pick which panels of your jacket you want to be sheer. Okay. Cut them out. Grab your floral embroidery. And from the back side, all that you want to do is add a little bit of fabric glue. So this is totally no wow. sew. Great for beginners. Lay the fabric right on top of the opening. Press it into place. And then you just cut off your excess. So you don't need to be cutting these pieces like perfectly to pattern. Look, right. I'm just cutting off what's not glued down, it's which beautiful. means that it all fits in perfectly and yeah. it's totally no so which is great for beginners okay so we're doing the the flannel because oh, here's oh. A, because here the flannel is so confusing because it looks yeah. like it should be easy yeah but, but then you, you got it like the fit the plaid pattern has to be right yeah you can't just throw yeah. anything yeah yeah, yeah yeah what do you think I, i'm gonna say d d mm, diy they're buys. <gasps> They're buys. Oh. And you know what's so, which, what is such a good example about this? <laughs> Scott left. Yeah, he's out. He's we'll out. We'll see you later. Oh, it's been real. <laughs> the, the thing that's so great about these is that they are meant to look like they were DIYs, right? They've got this uh, ragged fridge uh, edge. Okay. They're meant to look handmade, which makes right. them feel really special. Yeah. So it is a great opportunity if you want to try to DIY, but you do have to know how to sew in order that's to do this. The, and that's the yeah. reason why for a lot of people it's going to be a buy. Too. Okay, okay. okay so our then? last one, you oh, guys, boy. these feather jeans. Oh, now, the jeans. Yeah. Sibley is proof I'm that ready. feathers are a major, major trend. Super high end, do. super designer, very, very <laughs> expensive. And you're seeing it everywhere on dresses, on yeah. jackets, on the cuffs of t shirts, like everywhere. Okay. Yeah. Do you think that these jeans are a buy or a DIY? You gotta buy that. You gotta buy that. You gotta buy that. You gotta buy that. You get, where are you gonna get some feathers from? DIY. I'm thrilled that you're wrong. <laughs> and Sibley is correct. Because I'm actually going to show you guys how to make them. Are you ready to make we, them? Are we yes. going to make them? Please join me. Yes, right yes, around yes, the corner. Oh, we should have known. It's right here on the table. <laughs> Get on over there. Yay. Okay. So what I love here is you can see there's three different versions. 
I got all of these feathers at a place called the Feather Place, which is in downtown LA. Okay. The good news is that they have a website, so no matter where you live, you can in the country, it. outside of the country, you can get them. Scott, the version that you have there is a thicker version of the Marabou. That's $9. The version you have here is the smaller Marabou. That's $3. The version I have, which is called the two-ply, it's the mixture of both, is $35. Right, so for That's, yeah, that looks three so nine or thirty five dollars, you instantly have a designer look. Now, yeah. what you guys are going to do is here's the boa. You can feel on the inside that there is a rope going through the inside. Yes, we're going to start on the edge here, on the edge of our jeans, on the corner. I'm going to go to the inside so that I'm not dealing with all the feathers. Okay. Step so you're going to take your needle <laughs> and you're going to go underneath <laughs> the rope until you can basically feel it right there, and I'm going to pull through. That's one stitch. Now I'm gonna move about an inch, again, underneath the rope Feel and it. pull. And that's it, it is a step and repeat process where you're just basically dealing on the inside so that you're not getting tangled up in all the feathers. I'm this gonna is, take it. This is, is actually together? like calming. I'm gonna take it up the leg. Is this calming to do? Oh, look at you. I'm gonna go. Oh, wow. Actually, may okay. I use what you're doing as a opportunity to give a little tip? Yeah, yes. come on, give me a tip. Yes. Okay. yes. You wanna make sure that wherever this is being applied, it is not in a place that needs to stretch. So mm. like uh. that actually would look really cool until you have to put it on because the feather boa doesn't stretch. So for example, like skinny jeans, you wouldn't want to put it on the hem of skinny right. jeans because then you can't get it over your foot. Well, listen, all I look. got to say is, early, you did it right there. Yes. That's a, that is a ta-da moment. So yeah. good. If I ever see, and I will be selling mine on eBay if you guys want to <laughs> check that out. You can send a Venmo to me. <laughs> right. uh, for more DIY <laughs> ideas, check out Orly's YouTube channel. So fun. And coming up, Vanessa Hudgens takes on the TikTok flexibility Ooh. challenge. Okay. All I know is that a head goes up, a shirt comes off. You don't want to miss I wanna, it. I want to know whatever that's about. Leg goes up. I love shirt. Shirt goes up.